hello and very good morning to all of you uh, so this is actually the continuous of the last video uh, about the advanced energy monitoring system uh, I have created one video uh, but this is the updated file I have added some more features in order to make it more efficient and uh, user friendly so what I have add, uh, added let me just first uh, describe it the one thing which I added is actually the smart meter this function uh, was not present in my previous video ok I will discuss about these things and the second I uh, add the EV charging system uh, we if we have a vehicle so um, if you charge it then the charging status vehicle color will be changed and the battery discharge state uh, let's say if you are running uh, your load on the battery so the battery discharge uh, state will be shown in this graph and the same uh, the remaining things is almost same uh, which I have discussed in my previous video I will set the link in the video description so that you can uh, watch that video also okay so just uh, let me uh, show one by one uh, I just run this program and explain you let me clear this uh, graph Okay. Uh, okay. Everything is now fine. Okay. Let's I run the prompt, and the same. Uh, you can see this time my load is working on the solar. So the load I have on switch on my AC, my fridge, oven. These are the total load according to 1.5 kilowatt, 1 kilowatt, and 1.2, and the current becomes of this three load approx. Uh, 15 point something if you want to see that current uh, the total current you can also see from here this is a 3.8 3.7 total uh, kilowatt hour consumption of this three load let's say if I also switch on the fan and also the light then the load become 3.8 okay if I down make it down uh, oven now the total load be, uh, total load become 2.6 kilowatt and the same uh, if I go to uh, uh, array number one then it's showing that the total export kilowatt uh, what does it mean is export kilowatt uh, it is like that assume that uh, my solar system have a total capacity of 10 kilowatt okay out of that out of that what uh, how many kilowatt I am using 2.5 or 2.6 like that okay so the remaining kilowatt means it becomes 7.4 uh, actually 2.6 uh, kilowatt is being used in the load and the remaining 7.4 kilowatt being exported to the uh, city uh, city uh, wabda or you can say that the electricity provider uh, in your country or in a city so this is the export now you see the battery full has already charged it is become uh, actually I have the uh, 100 ampere voltage um, added ampere uh, uh, battery which showing the total 100 voltage uh, this time so battery has actually full ok battery indication is showing that here is a full now if I go to smart meter 2 this is showing the total current the load of the current this one if I let say make it on now this is 17.2 ampere total ok so this is a smart meter and now let's say if I make a uh, EV charging and also the car is charging colors has changed red if I make like this one car not charging and you can also see here current adding ok current adding ok now uh, the second thing is that uh, in this uh, updated that let's say if I am running on the solar and uh, my, my, if I switch off my solar main breaker and also grid main breaker ok now uh, in that case I will switch my load to the battery ok I switch my load to battery now the battery meter uh, battery load is uh, now, now the load of the current uh, load of the home is also shown on the this meter the current and the power according to this uh, switch on condition and this is the battery discharging state that the battery is be then discharged at what state is being shown here you can also make like this one charge charging 
not charging okay so batting charging state will work only when you have a selector on the solar and uh, if you make the this selector to the battery or either off so this is a charging curve of the battery this is as actually 100 is not the voltage this is actually the total time uh, on which the battery uh, become full charge okay and the same this one is actually the discharging state of a battery this time by the passage of time is being discharged exponentially so this uh, two or three things car charging smart meter and battery discharging state i added in this updated version of advanced energy monitoring system i hope you would like this video if you like please don't forget to like and subscribe this okay till next video take very good care take care and allah is